Today we're going to talk about the Health Records tab. The Health Records tab was uh, mainly created to store imaging results or lab results. Yeah, it was created with the, with both the doctor and the patient in mind. Some doctors store the medical records, the imaging results. Some don't. So depending on your specialty and how you really operate, you don't really have to store them. You can just ignore this tab. Some some doctors look at the medical records more often and rely on it. So they store it here. They take a picture of the results. They can import the images from the email and just store it here. Uh, when we release the patient app, the Sirius MD patient app will allow the patients to store their re records for life. So once they do book a schedule with, uh, with you or other doctors, they can allow the doctors to see the lab results. These records will sync with the doctor's app and will help doctors with their diagnosis. You might be thinking, how about uh, what the doctor adds? Would that show up for the patient? Well, not automatically. It still needs your permission before the app will share anything, anything to the user. The main goal of SiriusMD is to save millions of lives through better information. With SiriusMD, you'll have access to the medical information that you need at the palm of your hand. You'll be able to diagnose better and you'll save more lives in the process. So let's get started. Here's how you add a, a health record. So at the top right, you'll see a button called Create Health Record. Just tap on that. Now, all you need, let's say you asked for your patient to get an x-ray. All you need to do is look for the type here, tap, and go to imaging and look for an x-ray. Let's say you got the, uh, the result date was yesterday. Just tap on the date, select there. And it's uh, the lab name and the remarks are optional. Say you just want to add some notes there, you can just add them there. Um, the required part here is the add photos part. All you need to do is add, tap on add photos. Now it's, it's up to you if you want to crop the image. Over here you say this is the only part that you want to see. Tap on the check button and there, now you see it. You can add um, extra photos if you want to by tapping on add photos again. And you can say, let's say you have the image in front of you, just um, press on camera and the camera will open. Okay, so that's it. All you need to do now is just tap on the create button and it'll, uh, you'll see it there at the top. Um, it's gonna sync to the server and it's backed up now. You can arrange your tests here and can filter out the, um, what you want to see or what you don't want to see. And you can arrange by date. That's it. That's really much it. So if you want to edit it, say uh, the x-ray again, if you, you can just tap on it if you want to look at it. You can zoom on it if you want. At the right side, you see us our um, edit button. The it's rectangle button there below the create health record button. Just tap on that if you want to edit it, and this pop up will show up again. Um, let's say you want to change the lab name here. Just tap on lab name. Add something there. Test clinic. And. Uh, tap on update and that's it test clinic shows up in the lab name and you're good to go on the web app um, if you use the website to access um, Sirius MD um, which is on SiriusMD.com slash doctor uh, you'll be able to do the same thing all you need to do is just import the image and you're good to go it's basically the same process and that's it Thank you for watching this video. Um, we'll be back to add new 
um, new tutorials and other best practices videos and how-to videos soon. As always, we're here to answer any of your questions. You can just log inside the app and you can just go here. At the side, and you tap on the support button at the lower left and just talk to us there. Talk to you soon. Bye.